Hold on one second. Oh, it's Sam. I should probably take this. Oh, yeah, of course. Um, I'll go check in on James and maybe take a couple pictures. Okay. Sam, hey, what's up? Hey, I'm at the country house that fake nurse brought you to. You didn't have to go there. Um, Dante said that the Pawtuck police already searched that place. Yeah, but... An extra set of eyes never hurt. Isn't it getting kind of late? I mean, don't, don't you have kids to go home to? No, actually, I have Christina. She's watching the kids tonight, and she's prepared to spend the night if she has to. I'm not going to rest until I find out what happened over here. question is, what took you so long? What? I know it's hard for you to believe, but I actually have other cases I gotta work on, too. Which is exactly why I'm here. Look, I'm focused on finding Louise for Maxie. Nothing else. I suppose I don't even want to ask you how you got in here. Isn't the point to find Louise? Yeah, which is why I was just talking to the Pawtuck PD and went through their file from their search. Was it thorough? Yeah, yeah. Seemed like a fine police department. Okay. Then what are you doing here? I want to check this house out. I want to, more importantly, meet the owner if he shows up. Wait, do you think he has anything to do with Peter? I don't know, but I think I should ask him some questions. I hope it's okay with you two that I just walked through that door because I do own this place. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's fine. I'm Detective Falconer, Port Charles Police Department. Pleasure to meet you. Yeah, you too. Yeah. And you're his partner? No. No, no she's no. a PI and a friend of the family. Oh. And your name is? Austin. Like the city. The one in Texas. Mm -hmm. Wait, you're the country doctor who delivered Maxie's baby. Mm. Yeah. That'd be me. Excuse me. And you happen to own the house where Maxie was held. I might say that's quite a coincidence. Yeah, not so much. I own quite a few properties around Paul Tuck. My family's been here forever. You think I had something to do with Maxie's kidnapping? Did you? No. You know, Sam does make an excellent point. You own this house. Maxie was held here. You're the one who delivered her baby in the woods. What are the odds? You know, you big city slickers with your big city suspicions. <laughs> I hired an agency years ago to oversee the day-to-day -day management of my properties. Hmm. So I have no idea how Maxie wound up here. Well, we have our big city suspicions because your name keeps popping up in the investigation. 